Leah! What? What are you doing? I'm fixing Millie's gate. Why are you fixing Millie's gate? Because she busted the plywood off of her other one. Made herself a little goat doggy door. And she can't get back, back in it. It only pushes out one way. So I'm going to make one that she can't get out of at all. What else are we going to do? Uh, we're going to put our Dutch doors on the uh, tops, on the windows, and then I'm going to add um, an exterior door to the goat shack for the young girls. Awesome. What are you going to do? I'm going to stand here and freeze. <laughs> okay. All right, so the um, warm Christmas that we had turned to a very, very cold New Year. It's only 20 degrees outside, and so it's um, time to close these in. It's going to continue to be cold. It's even colder at night, and these mamas are going to have babies pretty soon, and we want them to be nice and safe and warm. So we fixed this door uh, where she'd broken through, um, replaced it with something more sturdy, and now we're going to put in our Dutch doors like we did um, in the other two stalls. So we'll have four Dutch doors to make. And then we're going to go ahead and put panels on the face uh, on the outside of these pallets to also protect them from the temperature and from the wind. Um, when we built these uh, stalls here, we used a lot of reclaimed wood from when we um, took apart the back porch. And so as you can see, it has started to sag. So for our doors to hang square, we had to put uh, level boards up to make sure they're nice and level so everything, everything hangs and lines up just right. Okay. She has feelings about this piece of wood. So this stall is done. We just need to put uh, handles on the doors. We're gonna put uh... what's that thing? Yeah, don't worry about that right now. We're okay. not. All right, handles, stalls done, weatherized and ready to to keep the goats nice and warm. Now we just gotta do that one. Millie. Hi, pretty lady.
needed today were made from reclaimed wood, except for the two new sheets of plywood that we had to purchase, and they were $54 just for the two sheets, the four by eights. So that's why we did uh, as much as we could with stuff that we already had. Hey, I bet you're glad that gate's there, huh? Hey, I'm the one who asked you, please, could you put this gate in? Because we needed it. Um, another thing that we added uh, to this uh, shack that we put out here for the goats is a wall to, you know, keep the wind break. But now that it's going to be freezing, we need to go ahead and put them in at night, especially when the temperatures drop really low. And so we've noticed that a couple of the girls um, push each other out. So not all of them will stay in on their own. They'll come and they'll lay real close to uh, the building. But we need to keep them all inside. And so I went ahead and installed a door today. So now they'll also be able to not push each other out and stay warm and stay safe. Like my little door? Uh-huh. I built it. All right, well, we want to thank you for joining us uh, as we have gotten our barn ready for this winter. And we hope to see you next time. Thank you. Bye. Hey, Leah, you got a mess in your barn. That's a joke? It's not a joke, that's a fact.